flagship event, not for Nigeria alone, but for Africa, is the biggest, sanctioned by the world body. So, uh, after this, a whole lot, I'm telling you because um, we have seen the performance of our players, there's still a lot of room for improvement. So we're not going to rest in our hours. Um, we are going to have quite a number of national open tournaments because we need to keep our players busy. That is the only way they can improve. And if possible, we we'll see how we can get a few of them to also attend some other internationals in the African continent. We want to keep them busy. So, uh, well, uh, we've been preparing for it. Really, you know, this is the third edition. So, the only reason why this was a bit challenging, but I'm still happy it came out very well, better than what we did before, is the fact that we changed venues. We had to come here because we have a larger capacity for audience and spectators, which is what we wanted to do. So, but by and large, um, I will tell you that most of the things are things we've done in the past two editions. So, we're, we're all looking at how to improve on what we've done before. That's why you can see that the delivery is better. So, uh, we, can't, we can't do this and wait till the next edition. No, no, no. We are going to keep them busy. We are going to have programs. We are going to have training programs. And then we are going to make them attend tournaments. It it's, it's about confidence building. A lot of them who, who narrowly lost here, it's very obvious that it's as a result of lack of exposure, not because they didn't know how to play. So there are little things that come to play and those things now make a difference.